It looks like Superman has saved the day once again, this time for an out-of-state couple. Their business had failed and they were facing foreclosure, so they started packing up and found something unbelievable. CBS 2's Roseanne Teus shows us what it is. Comic book superheroes have been coming to the rescue for decades, but at Chicago Comic Con at the Stevens Convention Center, one of these comic books is part of a real-life rescue story. Here we have Action Comics number one. 5.0 condition, the comic book that saved the house. The real characters want to remain anonymous, but their story starts with catastrophe looming and their house being foreclosed. Facing an uncertain future, they were going through boxes and packing to leave. That's when they came across Grandpa's old copy of Action Comics and said to themselves, this must be worth something. And <laughs> worth how much money, do you think? This comic book should sell for well over 300000 This is the first superhero. Without Superman, you wouldn't have Batman, you wouldn't have Spider-Man, Fantastic Four, X-Men. And it cost 10 cents this is, this when they bought 10 it. This was 10 cents when it came out in 1938. Here we are being able to make money for this family, make some money for us, and uh, save a home. Uh, it doesn't get any better than that. It's the closest thing I'll ever get to being a superhero myself. That action comic book goes up for auction online on August 27th. Wondering how long before your comic books are worth any money? Roseanne says the Walking Dead comics from just a few years ago are worth several hundred dollars, and a good copy of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles from 1984 sells for 5000 Who knew?